Hello again, it's me, and me you know by now, it's Joy. It's Joy Ruffin coming to you from the Sunshine State, Florida. Not so sunny today, lots of rain. We need the rain, but rain is not one of our favorite weathers. But we have to have rain from time to time. Today, my friend, I'd like to speak to you about how you can manifest whatever it is you want in life. It seems that everything goes in cycles, and this time around, the really big cycle that's in place, and most everyone is, has attached themselves to, is the laws of attraction. And it's very simple, really, because it means exactly what it says. How do you attract to you the things that you really want in life? How do you surround yourself with the people that you want to have in your life? How do you decide that you want to attract to you all the things that are going to make your life better, easier, more compassionate, giving, loving, and all of those things? So the way that you can manifest, there are many, many different ways, as you well know, to do this. But how you can manifest what you want in this life is first off, to start off being the person that you want to be in your life and attract in your life. So once again, it comes down to what? It comes down to working and evolving into being the best that you can be. You see others who have something or things that you want and that you desire all well and good. As long as there's no jealousy and there's no envy involved, then you can find a way to attract those things to you. Now, it sounds very elementary, and you know this, but sometimes we need to hear things that we know. We need to see things that we need to be able to understand. And that is your attitude. Attitude is everything. A smile when you're not feeling maybe like you'd like to smile, a kind word when you yourself are not at your best. All of these things will attract to you and put inside the core being of you what is already there lying dormant to be released anyway so that you can start to attract to you the things that you want, so that you can manifest in your life the things that you want. So as always, you know that it's always food for thought. It's just the beginning seed planted so that you can start to think in this direction along this path and move gingerly and gently in this direction so that you can attract and manifest in your life the things that you want to have. And in that this will be an ongoing series, we'll talk about more about what it is that you really want. And you need to be clear on that. So... Until the next time, my friend, you be well, you take care of yourself first, and then each other, and know that we'll be back again soon to talk with you more about how to manifest in this life what you want. So be well and take care. Until the next time, bye-bye for now. Cheers.